knives made from bombs. Find out how Taiwan master craftsmen turn tragedy into treasure. Welcome to China Uncensored, I'm Chris Chappell. They say when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. That's what this guy does. Only instead of life, it was a Chinese Communist Party invasion. And instead of lemons, it was bombs. This is the island of Jinmen. It belongs to Taiwan, aka the Republic of China. But just five miles across the water, that's mainland China. For decades, the Chinese Communist Party shelled the island. The blockade made life on Jinmen difficult. There wasn't even enough metal to build basic things like farming tools, nails, or screws. But there were over a million discarded steel bombshells on the island. So Wu Congdong's grandfather, a blacksmith, started turning them into those basic tools, and then eventually knives. Now Wu Congdong carries on the tradition. I visited Maestro Wu's workshop in Jinmen to see for myself how he turns an old communist bomb into a work of art. Old discarded bombshells fill Maestro Wu's shop. Built for destruction, soon each of these will be transformed into an exquisite knife. First, we select our bomb, and they are heavy. Maestro Wu cuts a small section of steel. Each shell can be turned into multiple knives. The steel used in bombshells is particularly dense and solid, perfect for knife making. The piece of steel is heated till it glows. This machine hammers flat the steel. In the old days, this process was done by hand. Maestro Wu repeats the process of heating and pounding, shaping the blade's thickness. As a master craftsman, he can determine the right thickness by feel. It takes years of experience to get it right. An incision is made in the steel, and that gets pounded with the hammer into the knife's handle. Now, a machine is used to cut the edge of the knife. A grinding wheel refines the blade. As sparks fall to the floor, the knife begins to take shape. Each wheel becomes finer until the knife is buffed to a fine sheen. Finally, Maestro Wu stamps on his seal. And as a special treat, he engraves something extra into our new butcher's knife. China Uncensored, Zhongguo Jiemi. The perfect end to a communist bombshell.